Once you have identified the unique four-digit section numbers for each of the classes you wish to add, you must go to your student portal to register for them. From anywhere on the SRJC website, you can navigate to the login menu and then click on student portal. After entering your SRJC ID number and PIN code, you will see the student portal landing page. Expand the admissions and registration menu and then click on add drop register. This takes you to the registration screen in the legacy portal, also called My Cubby, so it looks a little different. First, you must select the semester that you want to add classes. For this example, we will select summer 2023. The first time you try to add classes for any semester, you will be asked to update the information on your SRJC student record. Review your mailing address, contact information, and preferred first name, and then click update account if there are any changes or no changes to proceed to add classes. There's also a statement about the Cal Grant B Award which does not apply to international students, but you must check the box that you've read the statement and click continue. Finally, you must confirm your education goal and major. Finally, there are some questions related to federal and state financial aid and services, but most of these are not applicable to international students. Finally, when you get to the add drop screen, you can enter the section number for the class you would like to add. We are going to enter 8293 for Business Administration 10. Finally, when you get to the Add Drop screen, you can enter the section number for the class you wish to add. Let's add a section of BAD 10 by entering the section number and then clicking Add to Cart. Next, you can review the information, like the course title, and select a grading option for this course a letter grade A through F, or a grade of pass, no pass. Be sure to consult your counselor if you have any questions about this choice. On the next screen, you have the opportunity to view the classes in your cart. If you want to add more sections, click on the More Schedule Changes button. Let's add ESL 10. Enter the section number and click Add to Cart. Then select Proceed to Checkout. On this screen, you can review your enrollment cart, the enrollment fees for these classes, and you can also purchase optional services, like a parking pass or a photo ID card. If you are a new student, we recommend that you pay the $5 for a student ID, which will allow you to ride the local bus for free. Click Proceed to Checkout, and review everything in your cart. Before clicking, finalize schedule changes. Now your class schedule is complete and you can either view it here or navigate to the new student portal and find it under class schedule and fees.